I am old, I am wise, I am that which roams the skies. I am fierce, I am bold, I am that which shines of gold. I am fury, I am desire, I am that which burns of fire. I am fury, I am desire, I am that which burns of fire. Ayo, it's Halloween, finally, oh my god. I mean, it could be a little bit better, you know, if it was like on a fucking weekend, which it should be. If that should just be like against Halloween rules, that it's on a fucking Tuesday, like girl, <laughs> bitch wear, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, so this is actually the Halloween costume I used uh, last weekend um, for to just watch scary movies at my place because that's literally like the kind of person <laughs> I am. Like, could not be fucked to go out, girl. Uh, I did get a few invites, but it's just like always a whole thing. Do you know what I mean? And I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. A makeup like this is uncomfortable. And you really do not want to wear this for more than like three to four hours. Like after that, I was like tapping out. I'm like, girl, I'm done. This fucking prosthetic is like sitting on my nose and it hurts now. And I just, I just want to, I'm just done. I'm just done and I'm taking it off. So I did make this prosthetic myself. Again, it, I used um, liquid latex and... Um, What's that clay stuff that uh, Jordan Hans always used? Model Magic. Yep, and I used Model Magic for the horns. And then for other horns, I did use some uh, tin foil and wire and all that good stuff. I don't show you that in this because I'm going to just dedicate one video to showing you guys how I make a complete mask at some point. And uh, yeah, so I'm just going to like blow through how I did the paint job. I'm not really going to explain everything too much. It's pretty like straightforward color mashing until I think it looks okay. Like, I really don't have a lot of rhyme or reason. I'll try to put shadows where I think shadows should be and highlights where I think highlights should be, but honestly, I'm just like a fish flailing out of water. You know what I mean? Trying to find my way back to the ocean. So, <laughs> there's not a lot of instructions gonna be going on in this tutorial. I just wanted to like chat with you guys for a little bit. Um, just so you guys know, I do kind of feel like the Halloween community dropped the ball this year. Like, I'm not going to lie. There was uh, a lot of people who, rather than doing 31 days of Halloween, did 15. And then out of those 15, they didn't even do them all, which I totally get. Like, it is a lot of fucking work. And, like, I'm one to talk. I think I did, like, three or two actual Halloween tutorials this year. So, definitely, I also dropped the ball. But what I'm going to try and do is pre-film this summer so that I have all the videos ready for next year and I'm really gonna try and do the 31 days of Halloween next year so that is gonna be intense <sighs> and intense <laughs> I'm like already distraught about how much work it's gonna fucking be but I think it'll be worth it and I think it'll be super fun so if you guys have any requests that you would like to see next year definitely leave them in the comments below I did get this year uh I was asked to do more simpler makeup looks, so next year it will be like a collage of them. Some will be super simple, super easy, and then some will be definitely more complicated. So I'm going to have a good mashup for, for like beginners and diehards because, you know, some days you're just not fucking feeling it. Like honestly, if I was like going out, I would not wear makeup like this just because it is super uncomfortable. And then if anything starts to fall off, it's like, oh fuck, now I look like, you know, a drunk unicorn rather than a dragon. So. <laughs> But that being said, I fucking love how this turned out. This is the best prosthetic I've ever made. I can say that to date. You know, I will be surpassing this in the future, but this was just like a really well thought out and executed plan and I love how I painted it. I really want to do a reverse of this dragon and have it a dragon be black, blue, and silver or black, green, and silver. And I think that that would be really eye-catching as well. I just wanted to go with the red this time because I wasn't super confident in my paint job, like my, my paint skills are there girl and then sometimes they're not. So I wanted to make it a little bit easier on myself with, you know, giving people a hint like, well, it's black and red and I have horns on my face, I'm a fucking dragon, okay? Just live the fantasy. I hope you all had a good Halloween, I hope you all did something fun, even if you just stayed home like me, watched movies, it was fucking awesome. Honestly, I would not have 
my Halloween any other way. Um, we got the saw bundle for 20 bucks and it was pretty much, you know, a marathon going on. But anyways, guys, I hope you have a wonderful Halloween and thank you so, so much for watching.